So in order to um, untap the uh, limitations that we have on the uh, offshore wind market in France, there's a number of anticipation that we can carry out. We need to anticipate on the location of the future projects. This is called special planning. We need to have a special planning for the next uh, 30 gigawatts that need to be developed in France. Second, we need to anticipate on the grid connections. RTE, the transmission system operator, needs to start the construction of the grid connection much earlier than the construction of the offshore wind project. Third, we need to anticipate on the studies, environmental studies, geophysical and geotechnical studies, in order for the tenders to be launched without delay. So these studies need to be launched right now in order for tenders to be launched at the right time. We need to anticipate on infrastructures, infrastructures on the harbors in particular, because today the surface that we have on harbors is not sufficient to deliver the 2050 targets of the French government. We need to anticipate on education because we need a lot of human power in order to tackle these challenges. So anticipation is the key word if we want to deliver our 2050 targets. I will talk about development and I will use the word coexist in harmony because I believe that we as offshore wind developers can work in harmony with all the other activities that we have and all the environment that we have in offshore wind projects. I give you a simple example. If you are offshore, in the morning you'll have a fishing vessel and then two hours later you will have a sailing boat and then a bit later you can have a crew transfer vessel, a CTV, that is doing the maintenance of an offshore wind farm. And all this can coexist in a harmonious way. Of course you need to recreate rules, you need to be transparent, you need to talk a lot uh, but I think that this is a key condition for this market to develop and we can deliver it. We have done that in the San Azer project and today we coexist in harmony in San Azer. I would say sharing acceleration. Why? Because clearly what you can feel here in this market is the strength of acceleration. This is a booming market. We have many new players. Here you have regions, you have contractors, you have developer, you have the state, you have environmental consultants, you have companies that build technologies, and we did a lot of sharing between all these players in order to have a very strong market.